and what a streak of ruthlessness. She saw the legs wobble, and boom, she, she was went. in. I mean, you might have needed to be Sarah Connor from the Terminator movies to have any chance against Katie Taylor in there. Four punch combinations coming out from Katie Taylor. And not for nothing, Brian, but we got to give two champions their due. I mean, th these are two champions. They want to go out like champions. Round nine scheduled for 10. If you hear the yelling last round, that means you can end it here. Final 30 seconds, which she can. And maybe they clashed heads there, and Volante hurt to the nose. Now, she's been hurt by a lot here, but it looks like Benji Estevez is saying that's it. That's it. It's over. Katie Taylor with the stoppage. Rose Volante is complaining, and I believe she might have a certain point saying, hey, that was a clash of heads. That was a clash of heads to the bridge of the nose. It opened up that gash. But regardless, Benji Estevez was already taking a close look at Volante. One more round ago, it wasn't a bad stoppage, in my opinion. I agree, too, and yet I understand why Volante might sense a bit of unfairness, you know what I'm saying? Unfairness, yes, I get it. She's a champion, she wants to hold on to her belt, she wants to last the distance, but fighter comes first. She was being overwhelmed by a, by a better fighter tonight. She's going to revert to boxing. I think she's going to probably, after in the next couple of rounds, realise that 
using her boxing skills are going, to, are going to be what's going to get her through this match because this girl is tough and you can see she's in good shape. I said that at the beginning, Nick, she looks physically strong, she's tall for the weight, she's very lean, she has long arms, she looks really tough, doesn't she? So I think Katie Taylor should start to revert to her boxing and use her skills a little bit more. Oh, the legs wobbled there and Taylor was on her immediately. She saw the legs. Can't punch herself right. out, Let's go in. Well, she's landing solid shots and Connor's unraveling. Right hook getting through there. Connor in full retreat here. Oh, but she's coming back. Uh, she's taking punishment in coming back as well. Oh, oh huge. Oh, Steve Gray's going to step huge, in here and yeah. stop that. Stop, Quite yeah. right. Quite right. When you're boxing for a world title, you've got to give someone every chance. But her heart and her toughness could have got her in a lot of trouble it there. Could have Steve done, Gray yeah. has done absolutely the right thing. And what a streak of ruthlessness. She saw the legs wobble and boom, she, she was in. For it. Yeah, what a finish, wasn't it, really? Well, it's a while since we've had a Katie Taylor stoppage. Yeah. Well, that little drought, such as it was, has just come to an end in spectacular fashion there. You know, she stopped a tough girl there, Nick. Yeah. That girl was tough. She was. She was in good shape. Willing. She came to win, you know.